Hello, Subtain Haida, welcome to our discussion on the current situation in Iraq's financial land escape. Today, we're delving into insights shared by Intel guru Frank26 regarding Iraq's potential move towards a float state and its association with institutions like the WTO. Frank 26 emphasizes that these international institutions are keen on having Iraq join their ranks, hinting at a possible correlation with Iraq transitioning into a floating exchange rate system. He suggests considering exchange rate possibilities ranging from 1 to 1200, 1 to 1000, to a straightforward 1 to 1. The anticipation is for a dramatic shift that would warrant international recognition. Now, Let's focus on the time frame Frank 26 mentions. He expresses a keen interest in observing the exchange rate dynamics within the next five days, particularly after the 15th. This period seems crucial, and he raises the question of whether the exchange rate will remain stagnant, resembling penny stocks, or if there will be a noticeable improvement. In the context of this intriguing speculation, it's essential to keep a close eye on the developments in Iraq's financial land escape. The potential shift to a float state and the involvement of international institutions raise questions about the broader implications for the country's economy. As we conclude our discussion, Subtain Haida, if you find these insights valuable and wish to stay updated on such critical analyses, consider subscribing to our channel. Subscribing will ensure you receive timely notifications and stay informed about the latest developments in Iraq and beyond. Thank you for joining this discussion, and we look forward to exploring more financial insights together.